And now it is time for the mix, and we've got some pretty wild, good ones for you today. wild things for you. Let's start with this humongous alligator that the hunters in Alabama caught for us. A whopping thousand pound plus catch for these hunters in Alabama. And the length of this was logged at about 15 feet. Now that's pretty, Ooh. pretty big. It's a lot of gator. According to the National Zoo, the average size for a female is about eight to nine feet, but males can get over a thousand pounds, but this is very rare to, for someone to catch this. What do you do with all that gator meat? You know, at the Minnesota State Fair, you can get alligator on a stick. I want, do they carve it up? Do they sell the skin? What really, do they do in with Minnesota, the they have alligator on they a stick? They do have alligator on a stick. Check out the Minnesota State Fair. Very all right. nice. Moving on, though, we were just talking about running and the health benefits of running and maybe those snacks that you want to eat after. Well, meet a guy who is running cross country. This is Steve Knowlton. He can have as much as he wants to eat. He's running 3,414 miles, California to D.C., to raise awareness for America's veterans. Good for him. He's from Minnesota, and he's pushing that stroller you see there, which has water and a cell phone charger. Apparently, though, get this, Steve has already run across the country twice. Once previously to promote research for Asperger's syndrome and another time for Crohn's disease. 49 years old, I think he's burning a lot of calories what and a, a lot of pounds. What a great cause, bringing awareness him. to that. And moving right along right now, let's meet Turbo Roo. We're talking about mm. a little chihuahua who was born without her front legs. So the owner who adopted her decided to make this little contraption out of some former toys. Those are little skateboard wheels there. And little Turbo Roo is said to be doing great. And Ashley, the owner of little Turbo Roo, has certainly had some donations pour in and they also had a designer make a little 3d cart for i have Turbo never Roo. seen a dog <laughs> i have never seen a dog like that without front legs i've seen dogs with you know injuries to their hind legs or spinal cord injuries we've all seen them towing along those little wheels but turbo Roo is on a roll turbo is permanently harnessed to a skateboard there with those <laughs> wheels good for him apparently that little device was molded out of a 3d printer as well all right well moving on uh here's a guy we've been talking about all morning we're pretty sure this dancer doesn't have bones. Yeah, rubber Check band this man. out. This guy, Arthur Cadre, a break dancer, using his GoPro video here, and this video is courtesy of GoPro, but has to be the most flexible human being we have ever seen. Maybe he belongs in Cirque du Soleil. I don't know. That's just wild. I won't be busting any moves like that, but he is fascinating to watch.